document templates in ACT are a great way to quickly communicate any news or updates to your contacts, especially if you need to send frequent communications to large numbers of people. In this video, I want to show you how to create a new document template to be used with the Mail Merge feature in ACT. Let's say that I'd like to start sending out a simple email to contacts that I met at a recent trade show. To create this template, I'll begin by going to the right menu and I'm going to choose New Letter Email Template. This will open Microsoft Word in the background. So I'm going to click Word in my taskbar and I'd like to use the Mail Merge fields for this template. So I'm going to go to my Act tab at the top and I'm going to click the Show Fields button. Okay, we're starting from scratch with a brand new template. So I'll start with my salutation, dear, and then I need to double click the field I want to add next to that. In this case, I could choose first name or salutation. I'm going to follow that with a comma and then I'll hit return and I want to paste in the body of the email that everyone will see. So I'm going to paste that and then I'll end this by saying thanks. And now on the next line, I want to sign it with my name. So from the Act for Word window, I need to change this top dropdown from Contacts to My Record so that it adds my contact info at the bottom of the email. Now from here, I'm going to double click Contact so that it puts my first and last name there. Beneath that, I may as well add my email address and probably my phone number also. There it is. So all three of these fields should show up with the word my in front of them, meaning it's my information and not the contacts information. Once I finish crafting this email, I'm going to save it as an ACT document template file type. So in Word, I'll go to my file menu and I'm going to click save as. Now all templates must be saved within the templates directory of your ACT database. You could click the templates folder here, but if you don't know how to get to this area, Click Browse, then go to Documents, Act, Act Data, Databases, Your Database, and then the Templates directory. I'm going to name this template Trade Show Follow Up. And it's important to note that this file type is ADT, which stands for Act Document Template. It must be saved with the ADT extension if you're using Microsoft Word or the TPL extension if you're not using Word. So I'm going to click Save and now I can close Microsoft Word. Back in Act, let's give this new template a trial run. I'm going to choose one of my contacts and go to their detail view. From here I can go to my right menu and choose Email Message from Template. Now I'll scroll down to the template I just created and click Open. This is going to merge the template with your contact and it will also open Outlook with the crafted email. Notice that the first name for my contact appears at the top and my contact details show up at the bottom. The only thing left to do now is to give this email a subject and click Send.